So we're here at uh, Zapiti and uh, hi, who are you? Hi, I'm Damien, I'm in charge of the software development and research team. And who are you? I'm in the marketing part in uh, Paris. For so, so you have 4K player? Yeah. So what do you, which box are you showing here? So actually we have uh, three models here in the range. And we have the set of box here. Um, after that we have this model. It's a big model with two uh, racks for uh, stack, uh, two... Um, Huge hard drives. Yeah, uh, drives inside. Yeah. Uh, eight uh, terabyte. And we have a phone model with one rack for one HDD inside. Nice. Uh, so is this mass production? Yes, of course, and it's available right now uh, all over the world. How much is the price? The price of this one is uh, $229. Dollars. This one is $349. Dollars. And this one is $279. Dollars. And uh, what is the CPU that you use? We use uh, um, CPU from uh, Realtek. Realtek ARM Cortex A9 quad core uh, A7 A7 yeah yes. uh, and uh, I forgot the name of the CPU but can you show the software? So we'll yes, What's special about your software? So the, you have the, the covers the name the here. The model is uh, 100. Uh, one. The cover, but, uh, uh, it's very customizable. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you can. Right. Oh, yeah. yeah, so let, let's check out what, what kind of UI do you have in here? Uh, you can, uh, can you explain? So this is the UI of ZPT. Um, yeah. So you, you can show that uh, the software analyzes your movies that are stored yeah. on your Android and it will get down the uh, data, data, metadata from the internet, yeah. pictures, synopsis, etc. And it will update your collection to uh, arrange them, organize them into different Category. Okay. So can you show your Sorry. UI? Yes, of course. So this is uh, the main uh, UI where you yeah. just uh, switch off the player. Um, it's an Android box, so you can uh, install all apps from the Google Play uh, Marketplace. And uh, inside the, the device, there is uh, an app called Zapity Player, Zapity Media Center, that allows you to manage your movie. Collection. So you make a special media player center, media center kind yes. of app? Yes. Is it Android yes. based? It is Android based, yes. So you make special APK? It's a special yes, it's home, a APK, home yes, a launcher? Course. Special launcher. And uh, when you start the device, you can uh, automatically start the Zabiti uh, Media Center app. And we bring you all your more data, all your movies directly uh, on the device. So you can see that you have uh, the different uh, jacket posters of your different movies. And uh, for each movie, uh, you have a detailed description with uh, synopsis, rating, actors, directors. So if I have, if you have uh, eight terabytes of uh, uh, yes. pirated movies, let's say, okay, uh, is it gonna? <laughs> are you gonna be that. able to do all this for any DivX? Uh, what do you call it? The yes, MP4, also, everything. We, we are managing uh, all the. We are supporting all the all the codecs. And you and recognize the title and what it is. Yes, and you of put the, everything in. Yes, 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 yes. You it's very powerful. The identification is mutualized across the users. So if one user identify a movie, all the other users benefit from it. Can you uh, organize by uh, favorites or ratings, yes. or how does it work? Yes, you can. Uh, there are several ways to, to do that. First, you can uh, sort them in your movies, your TV shows, by alphabetically or by by, uh, by race, by duration. Uh, by recent edition, etc. Can we go back in the UI? What was that? Yes, this is the, the main uh, contextual menu where you can uh, launch uh, launch a movie, but you can also launch the trailer of the movie if available of you, you know, on YouTube. It automatically detects the right trailer and it uh, shows it to you. Uh, another cool feature is that you can download the subtitle if you need a subtitle for. Uh, for uh, what is identify again, for example? Uh, if the, it, something's wrong, it checks yeah, again for IMDb? If something's wrong, you just click on it, you type the right name, and it shows you all the possible results. So nice, you, you can, can change the image, yes, uh, scene, the ongoing, not seen, yes. all that stuff, you have it working? Yes, of course. Yes. So this is your media player? It is, uh, oh, yes. And how, how famous is this? How many uh, people use this? 
Uh, around 10,000. 10,000 10, users? Yes, 10,000. Yes. Since when do you exist? Two years. Two years? This project is available since one year. But the Zapiti app exists since uh, maybe uh, 2008. Everybody can download? Yes. So it works on every media yes. player? It works on PC, it works on Mac. Let's check it out. So you have it yes. on PC right here? Yes. You have it on iOS? Yes, it is a prototype. It's not yet available, but it will be uh, on your PC. So you have your multimedia management device on iOS, on a PC? And it is exactly the same experience. How does it work on PC? It's not Android. No, it's not Android. So but what it's is just, it? Uh, it's, it's, uh, it's an app. It's, it's uh, Metro? It's a... Uh, uh, some kind of, it's an app on uh, yes, Windows? Yes, it's, uh, it's, it's an Windows. app on Windows, it's a simple app, it's yeah. back. Yeah, and uh, we have the same experience for uh, all the, the interface, you will retrieve uh, the same, uh, same synopsis, the same information, so and your database is centralized. Yes. You can use, you can uh, get your collection on all your device, you don't have to recreate it for each device. When you, mer when you say that this, this movie is a scene, all your other devices know it. Do you synchronize with an uh, online video? Uh, no. Or is it only for an no. offline collection? Uh, it's for your own personal, personal time collection. on your local network. Do you have anything going on with streaming sites or anything? YouTube or uh, anything? We don't do... Um, uh, cloud streaming stuff? No, cl no, no cloud streaming stuff. Could you do it in the future? I don't know. <laughs> We it's a lot of work, right? All this stuff. I don't think this is really the, the goal of the app. It's really for your own personal file. And uh, something that looks like a string, it's still your personal file, but you can grab the iPad when you are moving and you will be able to stream your movies from home on your, on your iPad. Does it work? Yes, of course, yes. What do you mean, of course, yes? It's not easy, right? <laughs> it's not easy. How can you make it work? <laughs> you're streaming different bit rates. No, it yes, yes, does yes. the real tech the, encode the, the video no, transcoding? No, no. Oh. The Zapiti server does the transcoding. The you. server is on the box over there, right? No, no. The server is not on the box. There is several ways to have a server. You can have a cloud server, so your collection database, not the movie, but the database of your uh, collection, store online. Then you can access it from everywhere. But you can also have a local server on your own network, so you can install, when you install the PC app, it comes with a local server. So it can, this, uh, this presentation works with a local server on PC. You can have the server installed on, the, on uh, NAS Synology also. And it's a great, it's great feature because you have all your movie on your NAS, the ZPT server into the NAS too, and then you can do multi-room with uh, the Mini, the ZPT Mini. You can have one ZPT Mini in each room, and it will be uh, able to stream uh, your, your video. So this is huge. Why not giantly famous? <laughs> because uh, it's uh, really the beginning. The project. Where are you based? Uh, just... Where's your headquarters? Oh, we are in France. In uh, Paris? Uh, Paris, yes. In Paris? Yes. So you're a Paris company? Yes, yes. And where's the background of the team? What did oh. you do before? Um, is a secret? <laughs> no, 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 no. The project exists uh, since uh, 2008. At this time, we were importing and uh, selling um, hi-fi and uh, the Blu-ray, etc. Um, and we were selling a device called June that was a great device but with a poor interface. And we decided to create the software to enhance the interface of June. And it was the really first uh, big stage of uh, this project. Then uh, we create our first uh, device based on June hardware but called the PT Player first generation. Two years ago? Uh, maybe three or four years ago from now. Yeah? And two years ago, we decided to uh, design our own project, and uh, it was uh, released one year ago. So people can buy it on your website, or where? Yes, where can you buy it? We have a website where uh, people can buy it uh, worldwide. But we are currently uh, mostly uh, selling in France and in Europe, and currently we are trying to get distributed in the US. All right, it's fantastic. I hope uh, I hope it's real. <laughs> I mean, I hope it's nice to use. You yes, use it yes, at yes. home? Yes, yes. I use How I many uh, movies I, you have oh, in your collection? I have, oh, I have a small movies, but we have customers that have thousands and thousands of movies and it's work perfect. Like me? <laughs> All right, fantastic. So I'm looking forward to integration with the Pirate Bay and, uh, and online streaming and uh, uh, popcorn time. Yeah. Everything should work in your app. I'm just joking. We'll see. We'll see you later. Maybe, maybe.